All right, boys, we've got a Spinazzola today. Uh, four star, four star, that's nice. Right third, high medium work rate, six foot one, so he might be a bit chunkier. I don't know if, I don't know his body type yet, though. If he's lean, then he'll be, he'll be all right. But, um, yeah, four star, four star's nice. Good links, got Italian, Roma, um, Syria, yeah, that's really good. He can play left mid as well and left back, which is very, very good. He'd be, yeah, good left, left mid, left winger. But, I mean, the shooting will let him down if you're trying to play him there. I think left-back is probably the best place for him. Uh, good dribbling. He's got very all-rounded card, apart from the shooting, really. Uh, 85 agility. Nine oh, that pace is really nice. That pace is really, really nice. 97 acceleration. That's really good. I mean, and everything else is just pretty much... He he's hurl at gang, apart from the shooting, boys. I mean, he'd be a great centre mid. Ah, uh, yeah, great centre mid or CDM if you're going to try and play him in there. Uh, I think, for me, I'd play him like CDM or left back. I wouldn't play him as a left mid. I think the shooting will let him down too much in that case. But I think it looks like a very good card, boys. Right third, so if you're going to play him left back, then obviously you're going to have to cut in because of the right foot. But yeah, it looks like a decent card. Boys, I might just stick a sentinel in it, on him. If you're playing him as a left back, I would stick a sentinel on him. This is going to be plus eight. Uh, defending boost and a plus five physical boost and a plus one dribbling boost. So on it on his uh, flashback card, yeah, that will give him. Yeah, that's really nice. So uh, ninety defending, eighty five physical. I definitely stick a sentinel on him. If you're gonna play le play him left back, however, if you're going to play him as a left winger or a CDM centre mid player, I'd probably stick a dead eye on him, boys, uh, because he gets it gets a uh, a passing boost and he gets the shooting boost as well. So on his, on his uh, flashback, that would give him to 87 passing and 77 shooting. If you're going to play him as a CDM or centre mid, I use a dead eye. However, if you're going to play him ha as that left back role, I would use a sentinel on him, boys. Let's just see how much he's costing. He's three squads, which is quite a lot. 82, 84, 86. Not too bad. The 82 won't be too bad to complete, but the 84 and 86 are quite hefty squads. Uh, it depends if you've got the fodder and you're in need of a uh, Serie A left back. Alternative boys for the same kind of price, you could always go for this Teo Hernandez. Uh, I think he'd be around the same price as Spinozola, so 200k. But it depends if you have fodder and you want to make that Spinozola less expensive, then I'd prop the fodder into Spinozola. But I think Hernandez looks probably looks like a decent card as well. I mean, apart from, I mean, Spinozola's got more pace, but Hernandez will probably feel better in game. But it's up to you boys, let me know who you're going to do.